Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. It can be pretty rare for someone to record a Nexus crystal opening and say, Prof, I don't want to send you screenshots. I want you to commentate the actual video. So I waited until it was Thursday, until these crystals had long gone, although long gone is kind of an exaggeration. They've been gone for, I don't know, a few hours. At the time of releasing this, for Alpha Male, somebody who is not in an alliance, keep in mind, not in an alliance, who needs an alliance when you get crystal luck, right? Uh, alpha male to send this over. So, I don't know what he opened, but we're about to hit the play button. Shout out to our very own Mama Bear, who got, for the first time ever, back-to-back -back six stars from a $5 Nexus bundle. I have yet to do that. Alright, first one, Team Pop, and I mean... Three star, four star, whatever. Fresh out of the box is a six star Nick Fury. Look, I don't care what any of the other crystals are at this point. You have gotten so much more value out of the, the total sale than 10 bucks. Just imagine if Kabam said tomorrow or today. Uh, for units, shall we say, you can get yourself a six star Nick Fury. How much... And I know Nick Fury is an older champion, but for people who don't have him, how much would be people be willing to spend? I would say at minimum, minimum, like absolute minimum, 3,000 units. But really, considering his utility, it could be as high as 10,000. Maybe the average of those two, around 6,000, 6,500. So 3,000 units at the bare minimum is 100 bucks. This is 10 bucks, and he's got three more crystals. I love stories like this. They are so... Awesome, and this is why this can be the best deal ever. And even if you don't get five or six stars, and I didn't for several weeks, there are still far worse values out there for your money. Especially those Mythic Crystal Bundles. Ooh. Alright, second one. Okay. He can awaken his five-star Gamora. All of this is a bonus at this point. All of this is, is just added value. Who needs an alliance when you can get Nick Fury? Am I right? Or am I right? All right, third crystal, all three stars, not a big deal. Last crystal, can we go first six star and last is six star? Maybe. No, not even a five star. But he got his six star Nick Fury on camera. This is why you record everything, right? Now my question, though, is can he awaken him? Because 6-star Nick Fury without being awakened is just not that useful. It becomes half of a puzzle. He's got the 5-star Nick Fury. That's no surprise. Got some nice 6-stars. Does he have an awakening gem? Is he going to answer this question in the last 10 seconds of this video? Use items? No. Oh, man. It doesn't look like it. I feel like if he did, he would have shown us. Well, congratulations. You are halfway to the Nick Fury puzzle completion. I wish I could tell you you were closer than that, but that is not the world that we live in. Still, first crystal for technically $2.50 with a champion that easily people would pay thousands of units for. It's, it's an awesome story. I just hope it doesn't take years to awaken them, right? That's what's tough about these puzzle piece champs is that you can get excited about getting the champion, but like Nick Fury is the rare exception where at SIG 1, he's the real Nick Fury, whatever. But if you look at somebody like Aegon in the same class, you really want him as close to SIG 200 as possible. So uh, congrats, no alliance needed. Thanks for keeping this under five minutes. Have a great rest of your day.